Hello, and welcome to Peter Scott Cars. Today we have this 2016 Mini Clubman Cooper S Automatic. Just starting with the front of the car, I'll get as close as I can so you can see there's no stone chips of any note. As I get very, very close to the edge of the bonnet, really I'm struggling to see any stone chips. That is the case all the way along the front of the car. There's certainly no scuffs or marks to any of the bumper corners. As I take a step back and look down the entire driver's side of the car, can't see any parking dents. The car's got the 18 inch gloss black alloy wheels. All four of the alloys really nice, as I'll show you as we go around the car. Absolutely nothing negative to point out on the driver's front wing. That does include the plastic arch, free from any scuffs or marks. Moving on to the driver's door, exactly the same, can't see any scratches, chips, etc. The car has the contrast black roof and mirror covers, both of those mirror covers free from any scuffs or marks. Moving along the driver's door, really I'm struggling to see anything to point out at all. Get a close up underneath the door handle to show you there's no marks or scratches. Can be quite common, particularly on the driver's door. Car has the keyless entry, nice feature. Can't see any chips to the driver's door edge. Once again, can be quite common. Moving on to the rear door in identical condition to the front. Once again, struggling to see anything detrimental to point out. No marks underneath the handles again. Can't see any chips to the door edge. Plastic arch, free from any scuffs also. Can't see anything to point out on the rear panel either. As I've already said, all alloy wheels really, really nice. Just take you into the car from the driver's side. First, I'll point out the driver's step is unmarked. Can't see any scuffs to the plastics. Mini Cooper S kick plate all really nice as well as you'd expect with the age and mileage of the car all seats really really nice just get a close up to the wing and edge of the driver's seat can't see any sign of any wear to the edge of the seat the cars had the genuine mini over mats fitted from brand new so there's absolutely no sign of any wear to the carpets or footwells either just get a close up with the driver's footwell to highlight that really really nice inside just want to show you the driver's door card is unmarked. Can be quite common around the window switches and door handles to see a little bit of wear or markings to the trims, particularly on the driver's door card, but not on this example. Taking you into the rear of the vehicle. Once again, no marks to any of the steps. Seats in the rear really do look like they've hardly ever been sat in. Those overmats have protected all the carpets once again. Absolutely no sign of anywhere. Does have the dark roof lining. Just bringing you around to the rear of the vehicle. As I mentioned at the start of the video, absolutely no scuffs or marks to any of the bumper corners. Car does have the rear parking sensors. Just want to get really, really low down so you can see there's no marks to the trims on the underside of the bumper. Car's never backed over anything at all. Can't see anything to point out on the rear doors. Once again, no marks underneath the handles. Just taking you inside the luggage compartment. Parcel shelf is present all nice and clean they are the genuine mats fitted from new done the job and protected all the carpets doesn't even appear to be any sign of anywhere to the over mats themselves all really nice just lift them up so you can see the carpet no problems under there like new just get a close-up of the plastics in the luggage compartment to show you how nice they are, no signs of any scuffs or scratches. Sometimes people do buy these estate cars for the large luggage compartments and subsequently put big items in and scuff the plastics and rear of the bumper. But absolutely not the case with this Mini Clubman. Once again, get close up of the plastics, then show you there's absolutely no sign of any luggage rash to the rear of the bumper either. 
Just bringing you around to the passenger side of the car. As I lock down the entire side, exactly the same as the drivers, can't see any parking dents. Once again, just get a close up to show you there's no scuffs or marks to any of the bumper corners. Can't see anything to point out on this rear panel, no chips or scratches. Once again, no scuffs to the plastic arch. Moving on to the door, get a close up of the door edge once again, no chips, no marks underneath the handle. As I take a step back, can't see anything to point out on the door itself. I do want to take you into the vehicle from both sides, just so I can show you all the door cards and steps. As I said, seats in the rear really do look like they've hardly ever been sat in. Moving on to the passenger front door. Once again, really am struggling to see anything to point out at all. We'll get a close up of the door edge again underneath the handle. Cupress kick plate all nice. Again, no scuffs to the plastics. Passenger seat, as you'd expect, same as all the others I've already shown you. Once again, can't see any sign of anywhere to the edge or base of the seat. Over mats have protected all the carpets. Really is an absolutely cherished example as I go around the entire car, inside and out. Really am struggling to see anything detrimental to point out at all. It is worth noting we have all our vehicles independently inspected by the AA. That is a 128 point inspection, which includes a five mile road test by an AA engineer, just to make sure the car is correct on the road. As you can see from the yellow window sticker, this mini Clubman has passed that AA inspection. You can view the inspection report on our website at www.peterscottcars.co.uk. All our contact information is also on there. So if you do require any further info about this mini Clubman, then please not hesitate to get in touch. We are currently offering free mainland UK delivery on all cars. To have a car delivered, we just ask for a fully refundable £100 deposit. The car is then transported to your home address where you can test drive and inspect on your own. You only pay the remaining balance for the car when you're completely happy. If you have any questions about the delivery process or car in general, please do just ask. There you have our full walk around video. Thanks so much for taking the time to watch. Hopefully it was helpful for you.